ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm Skip Fine. I'm back once again with another app review. And in this review, I'm going to be doing a review on Asphalt Overdrive. And this is a new addition to the Asphalt series by Gameloft. And unlike all the other Asphalts where they've been in-depth racing games, this one's more of like if you've ever played Subway Surfers, it's a swipe back and forth type of game. You have to set lanes and you have to um, swipe to get away from objects and stuff and you jump jumps jump off ramps and stuff and you get like nitrous boost and all that and basically the whole point is to run from the cops that's the whole point of this is basically you just try to get away from the cops and once you do that you or whatever you want to call it and then you just move on and it gets harder and harder as the game progresses this is for more of the this game is for more of the leisure type like type person the average android user that just wants to have a nice, fun Android game that isn't in too in-depth. I feel like that's what Gameloft was really going for, was the average user, not someone that's going to go get Asphalt 8 or Asphalt 7 and really get into it as a racing game. And like as Asphalt 8, this is a free game, and if you sign in with Facebook or Google+, Plus, you get, you get like 10 gold or something, so you can go through that route, but let's get into the actual game, and... See, you got all these different cars that you can go through, so if you want to go through off, then you can do that. And there's a bunch of different cars. You can upgrade them. Um, you can also customize their color, decals, license plate to say whatever you want. And that's basically how in-depth this game really gets, because like I said, it is for more of the leisure player just the average Android consumer, and it is free, so... And like Asphalt 8, they have events and stuff where you can win, like, gold, money, cars, all that good... And let's just get into the actual gameplay. But like I said, this game is basically like, if you've ever played Subway Surfers, you just swipe back and forth, and it doesn't take much brain power to figure this game out. It's a pretty simple game, but at the same time... It's a very fun game. It is It is just one of those games that's just... Once you really start getting into it, it gets pretty addictive. And it is really, really, really fun. So I would suggest this, but... You know, just like any other game like Nice, it is very well made. And it just overall is a good game. As you would expect from games to make the best games on Android and iOS for that matter. And they really did pretty deliver here because what they really were going for how I feel is just that type of game Where any person can pick it up and play it and have no issue They weren't really going for a really in-depth game and you can tell that with how this game is It's like any normal Android game basically. It's how you would expect a Mobile game to be just very simple straightforward, but still a lot of fun and see the whole point is basically just to run from the cops and once you do that you win and then you know it gives you your amount of stars your score and all that good stuff at the end and then all that adds up to golden money and with that golden buy cars upgrades paint jobs all that stuff and it's basically just a very straightforward game and it is free and I really do I would suggest this to anyone because it is actually a lot of fun and like always, links to the game will be in the description below, and links to my Twitter will also be down there, so if you can go follow me on there, you get all updates to any video I upload and all that good stuff. But that's all I have for this review. Please hit the like button if you did enjoy, subscribe if you're new. But I'm Skipify, and peace out.